Uh, the message was loud and clear. Only get a test if you have symptoms. But that, of course, leaves part of the COVID picture hidden. Now, a new message and a new approach for one city. Liverpool, the setting for a pilot scheme to run regular tests for as many people as possible. The logistics supported by the military, the outcome keenly watched far beyond here. The man leading the project knows it'll only work if people can be persuaded to take part. I would encourage as many people as possible to come forward and, and take a test, just to reassure themselves that they're not inadvertently uh, risking their family, their loved ones, their work colleagues by passing on the virus because they don't know they've got it. And one of the key messages is look after yourself, look after your family, look after your colleagues, uh, look after our livelihoods as well as our lives. Covid is on the rise in our city and across the city of Egypt and it's having a direct impact on hospital admissions. Liverpool's mayor released footage from inside the hospitals here to show the reality of the challenges facing the city. His hope that the new quick turnaround tests, giving results within minutes, will reduce the spread of the virus. His pledge that people who are traced and told to self-isolate will be financially supported. We are working with government to make sure that we can fund and support those people that do have to self-isolate uh, and that they don't lose out. So it's, it's absolutely crucial that we try to bring down the infection rates and therefore the hospital admission rates. It gives us a real chance to, uh, to turn it around and start winning the battle against this virus. Liverpool's pilot scheme will begin on Friday morning at more than 50 locations across the city and with home kits too. A new testing regime being put to the test. And Peter, it's certainly an ambitious target. So how many people are going to be involved? Well, Sean, this had been originally billed as tests for everyone living or working in Liverpool. Now, that's a population of almost half a million people. In reality, it's not going to be that many because this new focus on testing people who are asymptomatic won't apply, for example, to younger children of primary school age. And it's going to be targeted very much at first at people who work in healthcare or are key workers. But the plan is to build from there with people being tested once or twice every week.